Hi guys, welcome to another YouTube video. I'm back. We'll see how this goes. I have a new setup here in the office. So we're gonna try to do some more videos. I apologize for the not so great lighting. My lighting is still in the mail, but I was excited to try this out. So we're gonna do an unboxing today of the gorgeous Lauren Phelps designs. This is the January kit. So let's dig on in. The first thing you see when you open it up is just so much beautiful pastel. I'm in love with all the pastels she did this month. Um, I think it's just perfect to kind of like, kind of go back in a little bit to all of the, um, to all of the colors. Since she did the black and white last month, I just really like the way she kind of is easing back in and didn't just jump back into bold colors. So, and as always, I didn't open anything. Just what fun would that be? Okay. Honestly, I'm going to do a video here soon about my black and white TN and kind of how I'm doing my 2019 planner lineup. I'm in love with the black and white, so I'm going to have a hard time switching for next month. So, there are some journaling cards, little flowers. If you love what you've got, you've got everything you need. That could not be more true. Just a little white space there, some circle white space, the side, and in the middle again. I love these. I like layering them in pockets. Absolutely great for pockets. Then we've got the one that she hand writes your name on. This is big and bold, and I love it. I'm a huge fan of that. And then this is what is in the kit. It's just the double-sided laminated dashboards, the coordinating vellum, the coordinating large sticky notes, journal card set, die cut set, top tab set, cascading page markers, 15 millimeter washi, four page mini sticker kit, hand lettered die cut, and the guest designers are Peach Bow Clips by Lizzie Booth Bows and some sequins by Pink Strawberries. So here are the Bloop. Here we go. Here are all of the gorgeous, gorgeous dividers this round. They're all double-sided, as you kind of saw. The first one is just this, with just the plain watercolor on the back, so you know you're probably going to use it like that. I guess it's the same either way. So, I like that. Very just simple, beautiful, really happy with that. Of course, the gorgeous bow vellum. I love the bows. I love the colors in them just absolutely gorgeous and again this quote is just perfect if you love what you've got you have everything you, you've got everything you need and I like that this is going to be used probably for February so kind of got that love theme but more about appreciating than loving somebody that's kind of cool I love these little like they're kind of hearts I guess they they're, they're, they are they're hearts but they're not like super bold hearts they're just kind of subtle I really like that with the watercolor on the back. We're bringing out more of the floral in the leaves here with just kind of that watercolor background and then the plain watercolor on the back. And last but not least, back to the green with just some simple flowers and then that leaf pattern again on the watercolor with that same watercolor on the back. Absolutely gorgeous. I like that her stuff is fairly simple. It's not super intricate. It doesn't try to go over the top. So it's super versatile and I just, I really, really like her kits. Up next, out of the box, I'm pulling in some bow bookmarks. I like laminating them and sticking these either in the front or the back because I don't really use just regular bookmarks. So it comes with, this is the same one as the little one. The little one is super cute. I like sticking it into a pocket and then I like sticking this kind of in the front pocket of my TN. So those are just absolutely adorable. Here is the washi. Hopefully my light is picking that up. I'm losing light real quick, guys, real quick. But it's just a nice little floral pattern, absolutely cute. We've got a peach bow there. This is the one from Lizzie Beth Bows. She is on Etsy, so make sure to check her out. She has one almost every month, and they're all really cute. So, And then the other featured shop for the month was pink strawberries with a little bit of sequins there. Honestly, what I do with this is I just flip it over, and I'll just stick it in just like that. I don't even do anything with it. I just think it adds a cute little addition without having to worry about the hassle of sequins, anything like that. So, 
Up next, we got the sticker kit. As usual, I'm not going to go through it. It's just stickers. Um, I don't really... I. I don't like using the stickers because then I don't have them anymore and that's dumb because I use all my other stickers just as easy so I don't know I just I don't use them that often even though I love them um, here is the sticky note card it's actually like a little you can do it like this and have it like this but you could also like tuck it into a pocket and have it this way so that's kind of unique that's really cute I didn't think about that that's cool and then last, but nope, I guess, nope, not last. There's two more. Then we got these little page tab things. They're little flowers. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, I laminated mine last time and then just took an X-Acto knife and kind of cut around here. Gonna lie, not gonna lie, it was kind of difficult, but totally worth it because now they're nice and sturdy and I don't feel like they're gonna like, if they fall off, they kind of stick around a little bit better and so... Um, what my mom did actually is she, when she cut hers out and she slid it on her page, she took a piece of washi tape across here so it stuck better. That was genius. I just didn't think about it. So, and then of course the die cut set. Um, let me find the middle here. Doop. Okay. So she put in the monthly, the, her little monthly view, the February, absolutely adorable. Then we have, again, the, if you love what you've got, you've got everything you need. I re really like that quote. I really like it. Got the heart cluster from the dividers. Uh, this was on one of the journaling cards. Oh, that's kind of fun that it's actually the half. So you could just overlap it over something. You don't have to cut it in half to make that straight line. That's really neat. Got a couple just individual flowers here. A couple little clusters, some leaves. Just kind of some little extra die cuts there. So, this is what's in the kit. I think it's a great, great deal. I will post a link down below. If you want to check out Planners and On, this will get you a little bit of a discount there. I think it's like 10% off, something like that. I'll post it down in the comments below, or in the below thing, whatever. Otherwise, I am back. So, let me know what you want to see. Um, I'm probably just going to do, like, unboxings and flip-throughs and things like that. I don't think I'm going to do hauls, just because I like to use my stuff right away when I get it. And so... I don't like for it to pile up and that'd be like a thousand little one minute videos. So I'll stick that stuff on Instagram and things like that for hauls. So if you like seeing hauls and things like that, just hop over to my Instagram, which is going to be, com I'll link that down below as well. So have a great day. Make sure you like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thanks.